And so we celebrate Christmas for that reason. Now on, on uh, the other Sunday, I talked about the wise men. Now of course that was later, but these wise men, and I say they were wise because they saw Jesus. They weren't wise simply because they knew how the stars uh, uh, could uh, study the stars and the astronomical bodies. They were the astrologers. They had the wisdom, but I believe they were truly wise because they sought to see Jesus. And then not only were they uh, the wise in that they sought him, but they, when they found him with his mother, they gave all that they had. And that should be an uh, inspiration to our young people. That we should be able to give all that you have to the Lord. And then all of us, and give an appreciation for all that He has done for us, and given His Son to come, that we share our gifts. And I say that after they had worshiped the Lord, they went home another way. Whenever you truly worship the Lord and give Him all that you have and, and acknowledge as you have done here and this appreciation you have and showing the love for each other that, uh, that you show forth the Lord's family until you come. You will always go home another way when you share all that the Lord has given you. So the true meaning of Christmas is the birthday of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ, and not Santa Claus. Now, I, I want to mention something else. I, I talk often uh, like uh, Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer, even though it is a secular song. But I wonder whether we really recognize it, uh, what was said in Rudolph the Red-Nosed. How many of you recognize what was said in Rudolph? You know, Rudolph, they say the reindeer had a shiny nose. Now, what had happened, it was like so often we don't acknowledge others. They ostracize because they don't have as much or, or they don't look like us. But when they are really recognized as Rudolph was because he was uh, Santa decided he could use him because of his shiny nose. Now, I know that you know what happened when uh, all those people piled up on their way to uh, Knoxville at the time there. And uh, it's because they didn't have anything to guide him in that area. But Rudolph was able to guide him and then Rudolph gained a lot of prominence. And then all of them, after he had gained all of this promise, then they began to recognize Rudolph. So often that's what happened. We went to someone else, gain a lot of prominence before we uh, acknowledge him and appreciate him. So that's why I can appreciate Rudolph. Let's sing just a verse of Rudolph. Rudolph the red-nosed reindeer had a shiny nose